Lee, results-wise, there's not much Saints can do to improve, but performance-wise, I guess there's plenty to work on still. Yeah, there's always plenty to work on. You know, being out there and getting two in from two is the most important thing. You know, we've put ourselves in a good position. Um, but performance-wise, out on the pitch, there's a few things we've got to work on, and we've worked on them this week, and hopefully they'll show it against Bath. When you've had those hard games, is it almost better than having two easy wins in the first couple of games of the season? Yeah, definitely. It gets you straight. Yeah. I was going to say, going straight into a Gloucester game away, you know, it's, it's what you want. You know, it shows that pre-season has really worked hard. You've really worked hard in pre-season. And going down to Gloucester and getting a win has shown. And then coming here against a very strong Exeter team and getting a win there is very good for us. Tough to go to Gloucester and win. Tough to go to Bath and win as well, I guess. But you led the side to victory there last season. Yeah, yeah, it is tough. Bath's a very tough place to go to and they've they've recruited well, they've got good players. They're two from two as well, so it's a massive game for both teams and we've just got to worry about ourselves, go down there, do the right things, play in the right areas, make sure our set piece is spot on and our discipline's got to be right as well because Barkley's a very good kicker, so we've got to make sure we nullify his threat from the boot. Where are they dangerous in open play? Uh, you know, Bendon on is a phenomenal fullback. You know, you think he's going to kick and he'll run. Um, Banahan's a very strong runner. And their wingers as well are very quick. Eastman's come in and showed last week. You know the try he scored. He's a very jinky, jinky runner, and we've got to make sure we watch both of them. We're all aware that we've not been firing on all cylinders this last couple of weeks, and there's areas of our game that we need to work on. You know we've started both games very well and, and finished them well, but um, you know the bits in the middle, um, letting teams back into the game is is not you know not good enough. So uh, we need to, we need to sort that out if we want to get a result down at the rec on Friday. You're one of the many new faces who featured for the Saints this season. You mentioned that letting teams back in has been a bit of a problem. Is that just a case of you guys just settling in those final little bits that you need to get right? Um, yeah, I think uh, I think maybe we're guilty of taking off, off the pedal of the touch. There goes the camera. Um, but um, I think it's certainly things that we can we can fix reasonably easy, easily. Um, you know, we need to once we get our noses in front, we've got. To, Start killing sides off. Otherwise, you know, we need to be more clinical in, when we get ourselves in those positions. If we do that, I think we can be a real force. It's been a pretty solid start for yourself, though. All in all, um, you've been happy with how you've been playing. Yeah, and no, I thought um, I was happy with uh, the Gloucester game. I thought um, played pretty well there, and I thought it was a little bit quieter here on on Sunday. But um, you know, you have those games, and uh, just trying to contribute as much as, as I can to the team. And, um, like we said, it's the, the main result is, is getting those two Ws and you know, hopefully that will make that continue.